Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Vivian, and I am filming on my personal channel. And if you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And today I'm going to be doing another Viv in the Kitchen video, but this is a little bit different. It has something to do with lunch, and here's what I will be doing once I get started. So basically, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a smoked salmon sandwich. And these are delicious, so you should definitely try this at home. So, I really hope you enjoy it, and let's get started. Okay, so today I'm going to teach you how to make a smoked salmon sandwich. So the ingredients you're going to need are bagels or breads of your choice. It could be white or multi-grain. And we're going to need smoked salmon to um, smoke salmon. And if you want to add a vegetables, you can do that, but in this case, you also need um, onions that are sliced up like like rings, half, half of rings. And make sure when you're cutting these onions, you want to be very, very careful. Okay. And of course you're going to need um, cream cheese. And I know most people use like goat cheese and ricotta, but now that now that I'm allergic to dairy, we use the um, Tofuti milk-free urban chive. So, let's get cooking. Okay, so the first thing you do is to toast the bagels in a um, toaster oven or a toaster. So I'm going to put two in here. and. And don't forget to um, plug in the toaster. So um, I always make sure that it's not too dark and not too light. And I will put this um, bagel slice in the toaster oven. Again, I make sure that it's not too dark. And it, this may take a about a minute or so. so now that these bagel slices are all toasted, and make sure to be very super, super duper careful. Okay, so now that I plugged in the uh, toaster oven, now let's start putting the salmon and the cream cheese and the onions onto these bagel slices. So, first thing I would do is to start off by applying the cream cheese. Okay, and next you apply these sm the smoked salmon pieces. And if you haven't tried the smoked salmon like this before, it does taste salty, but this is part of the ingredients needed to make a salmon sandwich. And I'd say put about like two to three slices. Now, you put on these uh, mini um, onion arches onto the salmon, which is on top of the cream cheese. Okay, so if you, here, here are some options, like you could either put the other bagel on top of the other one, or you could just eat it slice by slice. So now we're going to do the same thing to the third bagel slice once it's all toasted and ready. You don't have to burn yourself. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, ready? Yep. Okay, so now that the third bagel slice is already toasted, now you do the same process, which is putting the uh, cream cheese of your choice on top. You don't have to use Urban Chai, you can just either use original cream cheese or any brand. Next, you, again, you put the salmon slices on top of the cream cheese. Next, the final step is to put the onion arches on top of the salmon. Okay, and that's it. You're done making your salmon sandwich. Okay, so now the salmon smoked salmon sandwiches are done. Now it's time to try them and see how they are. These are really good. Guys, you should definitely try this recipe at home because it's very easy, very healthy. You don't have to make it quite exactly like this. You could just add your own like vegetables. Like sometimes people add cucumbers, spinach, or basically any greens. Or if you don't like salmon or onions, then you can definitely make your own sandwich. So, yep. All right guys, so that was basically it on how to make the smoked salmon sandwiches. So I really hope you all enjoyed it. So thanks for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe to keep up with me for more new videos. I love you all to the moon and back and I'll see you later in my next video. Have a great day. Love you. Toodles.